Imagine a future where the army moves across the battlefield on ultra-modern equipment, protected from any threats. One such vehicle is the Kurganets 25, a Russian infantry fighting vehicle that promises to be a real breakthrough. What makes it special? Why is it compared to the best Western models? Today we will take this machine apart piece by piece and find out if it will truly change the rules of combat. The Kurganets 25 is not just an IFV but an entire platform for various types of armored vehicles. It was designed to replace outdated Soviet machines like the BMP-2. The main difference is its modular design, which allows the vehicle to be quickly adapted for different tasks. For example, based on its platform, it can be turned into not only an IFV but also an armored personnel carrier or a fire support vehicle. But why is such versatility needed? The fact is that modern combat requires flexible equipment. For example, if infantry needs heavy fire support in one battle, the IFV can be equipped with heavier weaponry. In another scenario where speed is more important, a lighter armor setup can be installed. This provides tremendous advantages on the battlefield. One of the main advantages of the Kurganets 25 is its protection. Unlike old Soviet machines whose armor could only withstand bullets and shrapnel, the new IFV features composite armor made of metal and ceramics. This means that even if a high-caliber round hits the vehicle, it will not penetrate on the first attempt. Moreover, the vehicle is equipped with the Afghanet Active Protection System. Imagine a missile flying toward the Kurganets. Sensors instantly detect it, the system launches an interceptor, and the missile is destroyed in mid-air. This level of protection was previously available only on tanks, but now IFVs have it too. Now let's talk about armament. The Kurganets 25's main weapon is the 30mm 2A42 automatic cannon. This powerful weapon can fire both armor-piercing and high-explosive rounds. For example, an armor-piercing shell can easily penetrate brick walls, while a high-explosive shell can destroy enemy fortifications. Additionally, the vehicle is equipped with a 7.62mm machine gun, which is standard for engaging enemy infantry. But the most interesting part is the Cornet anti-tank missile system. With this, the Kurganets can destroy even heavy tanks. For instance, if an American Abrams appears on the battlefield, the IFV crew can launch a missile that will penetrate its armor. Now let's discuss the engine and mobility. The Kurganets 25 is powered by a Yam Z780 diesel engine with 750 horsepower. This allows the vehicle to reach speeds of up to 80 km per hour on highways. For comparison, the old BMP-2 had a maximum speed of 65 km per hour. The vehicle also has tracks, enabling it to traverse difficult terrain such as mud or snow. By the way, the Kurganets can swim. Yes, despite weighing 25 tons, this IFV can cross water obstacles without difficulty. Special water jet thrusters allow it to move through water at a speed of 10 km per hour. This is crucial if the army needs to cross a river or swamp. Now, let's compare the Kurganets 25 with its western competitors. For example, the US has been using the M2 Bradley for a long time. It is also an IFV, but it is heavier and less mobile. Moreover, it lacks a modern protection system like the Kurganets. In Europe, the German Puma is popular, offering good protection but at a significantly higher cost. This means that the Russian vehicle occupies a middle ground between light and heavy IFVs, balancing protection, speed and weaponry. This makes it a versatile machine capable of performing various combat missions. However, the Kurganets 25 also has some weaknesses. It has not yet entered mass production, meaning that the military is still testing it in real conditions. Additionally, it is unclear how expensive this project will be. If the vehicle turns out to be too costly, production may be limited, as has happened with other new models of equipment. But if everything goes according to plan, the Russian army will soon receive this vehicle, which will change combat tactics. With it, infantry will have reliable protection and powerful fire support. So, today we examined why the Kurganets 25 is one of Russia's most promising combat vehicles. If you enjoyed this analysis, be sure to subscribe to our channel, give this video a like, and leave a comment about which military vehicles you want to see in future videos. See you next time.